That's a perk for Ryan Wu, who's working on seven days rest, making his 15th big league start. That was if he's able to command the strike zone early on, two and four record for a four and a half ERA in seven innings. He has 68 strikeouts, 22 walks on the season. And we'll show you what he's going to feature. I mentioned the fastball. He has a four-seamer and a sinker. There's the four-seamer at 47%. The sinker he's more often lately at 27%. The cutter at 13%. Slider at 10%. And occasional changeup at 3%. Hey, got him. Tied him up at 93, running in on his knuckles. How about eight strikeouts for Wu? And was traded to the Astros in 2018. Next pitch is Chase. Strike three to Santana. Another slider gets him to Chase. And Thorpe's got his fifth strikeout of the night. Right center view. Doyle on the run. Can't get there. One hop up against the wall. Hallberg waving Davis home. Here comes the relay, cut off! An RBI double for Mitch Hanniger gives the Giants a 1-0 lead. Amazing at bat, some great takes. He finally gets the four-seamer. This is 1-0-5 off the bat to right center. That's got to feel good for Hanniger. He's hit a lot of balls hard, and it's just been right at people. Gets a little bit more loft on this one. To the gap, right center field. It's going to get down. Right off the base of the wall. Conforto scores. Davis scores. Wade stops at third. Another double for Hanniger. Two in a row. And two more RBIs. He's got three RBIs in his last two at bats. Cha-ching. Cash in the man. Mitch Hanniger goes for the double double. Get locked in. And that was a pull. Brett Kennedy on Friday. Christian Rowe Saturday. And Teddy Stankowitz again in the finale on Sunday afternoon. Here's a ball ripped by Lee out to left center field. The ball is carrying well. That ball will get over the wall. That's a grand slam for Brooks Lee. For the Saints here in the top of the eighth inning. They expand their lead to 11 to one. An opposite field grand slam by Brooks Lee for the Saints. Balls and one strike to count, or is ready to deal. This one line in left field for a base hit. With the breaking ball that stayed up and Lee waxed into left field. One ball, no strikes. Off the end of the bat, a little floater into center field, and that's going to dunk in for a base hit. So Brooks Lee is two for two. Make it work as the three two lifted into shallow left. Tough play here. Noel coming in and can't make the play, but the ball is down. Noel goes halfway over the wall. Garlic coming around to score. Lee on his way to third, and the stop sign put up there. That was a long way for Jackensie Noel to run. Nearly upended over the wall, and Lee into third with a triple. It's four two. And the first three hit game for Brooks Lee. Noel just could not get this over in it and almost could have put on the brakes. He's collected his first three hit game at Triple A tonight. He's got to find a way to get on the 0 1. I fly ball left field. Noel goes back. He turns around. He's gone. If you were waiting for the Brooks Lee moment, there it is. And barrels it up and cranks it into the Saints bullpen. Here's the payoff. Runner goes. Ground ball inside the first base bag. It rolls into the right field corner. Racing over to get it, Lopez. Around third is Helmet headed to the plate. On his way to third is Lee. The relay doesn't come. Lee dives in hands long with an RBI triple. And it is 1-0 St. Paul. Two batters in. Jacob Herbie's left, Jose Pereira in center, Henry Ramos in right field. Here's a fly ball to right. Ramos turns around. It is gone over the Humana Cabana in right field. Home run, Brooks Lee. His fourth home run as a Saint, his second of this series, and he has given St. Paul a 1-0 lead, two batters in.